This video tutorial will show you how to make a rosette using vintage ribbon. And vintage ribbon is just so soft. And you can tell it's just a little bit thinner than regular ribbon or grow grain ribbon or satin. And it's just so pretty. So they're really fun to use for so many different projects, one of them being rosettes. So go ahead and just cut a piece of ribbon. The longer the ribbon, the bigger the flower. And then we're going to take one end and make a knot. And keep the knot pretty close to the end of the ribbon. Okay, and then just take a dab of hot glue and put it on the back of your knot. And then fold down the excess ribbon. Okay, so now what we're going to do is we're going to roll the ribbon a few times and then you're going to take usually like I hold it with these two fingers after I've rolled it take your hot glue and just place the dab right on the side of that knot and then bring it over and then just let that get secure once secure just go ahead and roll it few more times and hold it with your other fingers and place a dab of glue just bring it in a little bit closer so you can see it better After a while you'll get to a point where you want your twist to be a little bit wider, not as squished, to make bigger petals basically. Now as you get towards the end, because we're going to fold the end ribbon under, Alright, and so this one is kind of a littler one, so you'll want a lot longer ribbon for a bigger one. And then there's the back. And now we're just going to get out our felt circles and add our clip. Alright, here's our finished rosette. And I'm going to add a gem to the center. And so we have these beautiful gems at theribbonretreat.com. We have a huge selection. They're so fun to dress up bows or flowers or other crafts. So I'm just going to add a dab of glue and then put it in the center. And then now I'm going to add my flower to a felt circle. I'm just going to put hot glue around the edge.
And then now we just need to add our clip. So now you take your other felt circle and you fold it in half. And you can see I made a cut right there and then you just cut it right there on one end of the felt circle. Then take your clip, open it up, and slide the bottom of it in. And then you close it. And then now what we're gonna do is we're gonna place hot glue on the back of the felt on the felt circle. And this will sandwich in that snap clip. And there's our finished flower. So pretty. So I'm making another one right here. And if you can see, I want to show you how much bigger the outside of these petals are and how I do that. So I have just glued it right here. And then I do a full turn again. And then just find a spot. Hot glue, and then place my petal or the ribbon down. The next one, you just keep continuing until you get to how big you want it. 